Welcome to another edition of the Eagle Staff Chat. I'm Casey. And I'm Ian. And Casey, Thanksgiving is right around the corner. I am so excited about this. I am so excited too. That's why today we get to hear from some very special guests about your Thanksgiving dinners. today with Chaz, our executive chef, and Emily, our pastry chef, and they're going to be sharing some exciting tips for your Thanksgiving meal preparation. Chaz, I hear you have a turkey tip for us that will help our turkeys stay nice and juicy. Yes, uh, um, brining a turkey works very well uh, to get a nice moist uh, result from your turkey. Uh, I'd like to use a 10% salt brine which equates to two cups of salt to one cup of sugar for every gallon of water. Okay. Um, you could flavor your brine with fresh herbs, um, sage, rosemary, thyme, garlic, peppercorns, whatever flavors that you like. Um, you bring that to a boil to melt all the salt and sugar, cool it overnight, and then soak your turkey in the brine overnight as well. And then do your regular cooking method. Usually comes out very good. That's wonderful. I would have. I actually would have never thought about that. Thank you. You're welcome. And Emily, I hear you have a baking tip for us today. What I are you going to be doing? I do. Um, I'm going to make some whipped cream. Uh, an easy tip just to elevate whether you buy a store-bought pie or your pie from home or any of your desserts. Whip your cream, um, like a 40% cream from Publix, a couple, couple of cups to a couple of tablespoons of sugar. Get it to medium peak. And then you can add all sorts of um, items to it. I'm going to put strawberries in this one. And then you whip it. And what happens is the strawberries turn it into strawberry whipped cream. And it turns pink. And you have just something a little different than just your regular plain vanilla. You can also use um, Grand Marnier or a spice like cinnamon, a little orange zest, and put it in your coffee or in your um, hot cocoa. Just a, a little extra tip to elevate your pie. <laughs> that sounds so good. Looks amazing. Thank you so much, Emily. Thank you, Chaz. You're very welcome. You're welcome. And if you liked what you just saw, make sure you sign up for Monday, December 12th, Get Cooking Class with Chaz and Emily. Little Birdie told me there's going to be cookies and treats. So this guy's pretty happy. And if you don't want to go through all the trouble of making your own Thanksgiving meal, just remember, the club will do it for you. You just have to sign up by November 16th. And as always, don't forget to check your weekly Twin Eagles Happenings newsletter for all your golf and social event updates. And from all of us here at Twin Eagles, Happy, happy Thanksgiving! Thanksgiving.